there is a strong temptation that when you convert your classroom uh, into virtual training, a strong temptation to make it like, okay, let's do it with a lot of video, a lot of e-learning, a lot of maybe even VR. The problem with those is that, number one, uh, your delivery date will become too long. Uh, so if you want to do it very, very quickly, my recommendation to you is to think of paper thin, <laughs> lightweight content. What do I mean by that? Examine your content, especially technical compliance and other data-driven information. Examine them and see how are people really learning them? Do they learn them by using a multimedia or are they learning them by using video or can they be learned by a simple PDF or a simple Word document for self-learning? So when you look at thin and paper light kind of content, two things happens. Number one, you make it accessible. You make it so friendly. You make it like a book so people can go in and out. You make it as a resource where people are doing their work. We're making them helpful for them to go in and out and learn from them. E-learning courses, I have nothing against e-learning courses. I love e-learning courses, has its own place. But not all of the content must be in an e-learning form. I think we need to let go with the feeling that we are less of a designer or a trainer if we don't have multimedia, if we don't have video, if we don't have animation and simulation. There's really more to my mind, a hang up that many of us have learned to the past 10 years that we need to produce content in a very high fidelity content. Try it, try lightweight, paper thin content.